it's Friday. Friday, Friday! Uh, I worked today, like every Friday, it seems like I'm working, but meh, life goes on. Um, I feel like I'm failing this vlog miserably because I, this is the second week in a row that I haven't gotten a chance to see anybody else's vlogs before making my video and then posting. Um, I mean, I look at, like, the titles when they, like, pop up, but, like, I literally have spent no time on YouTube this entire week. I've just been doing other things. I know, other things besides YouTube? <gasps> but, um, so there's that. Um, I don't really have much to talk about this week. Oh, I went to Barnes & Noble tonight because I was really excited because they were like, well, we're getting in this like a deluxe edition of the fault in our stars and i was like all right that should be pretty cool i want to take a look at it at least i probably won't buy it because i already own two copies because one is hankler fished and one is yetied um yeah so i probably won't buy it but it's still really cool to look at so i went and i looked at it tonight and it's so cool they've got a discussions page like page and a half of discussions for like questions to pose if you're using it as a book club book type thing. And then they also have like this much pages, like lots of pages devoted to a Q&A that John has posted on Tumblr, but they like published it into the book. So that's kind of cool. And then the other cool thing about it is they changed the cover. So it's still the clouds, it's still the black and white cloud, but instead of being a blue cover, like background behind the clouds, now it's like a silver. It's really pretty. And now the book is not black. Like, if you take the dust jacket off, it's not black anymore. It's now blue, like the book cover was. Now it's like a blue. And me, being a nerd, was like, all right, well, what's the stamp? Because I don't know if you guys know this, but whenever you get a hardcover book, there's always, like, a stamp or an imprintation on the front of the cover, like, of the hardback book. So, like, I've got books where, like, it's a little dog or it's the, like, penguin from penguin publisher or whatever so i was like i don't know maybe it'll just be like a star like something really simple really cute still fits with the book so i take the dust jacket off and it's his signature it's john green's signature it's j scribble is the indentation on the deluxe edition and it made me laugh out loud at the bookstore and the book like lady standing there was just like what's funny and i was like have you read this and she was like no i haven't read it and i was like you must read it's so good speaking of if you guys haven't read the fault in our stars by john green which is his newest book please go do so it's so so good um yeah maybe that'll be my book club book that'd be a good one um i'll have to think about it though don't hold me to that i might change my mind but it is a good book and if you haven't read it you should and if you're not nerd fighters become nerd fighters because nerd fighters are awesome literally they're made of awesome instead of bones and blood and guts and stuff. Awesome. Um, so yeah, I feel like this has been a rant of awesomeness about John Green because that's what my night was about um, after a horrible, awful day at work. So yeah. <laughs> Um, I will try and get better at this whole watching other people's videos. I was good at it, and then I have declined in my skills, so I will refresh my skills, because obviously they need it. And I will see you all next week. Yeah? Yeah, like literally, I will see you all next week. Um, I'm hoping. Fingers crossed. Um... One thing I wanted to address was that D also said he couldn't make the um, Sunday meetup because of work. I don't have work, but I have a church group that I attend until like 8.45 on Sunday nights. Um, it was just that one weekend that I had a weird Sunday that we didn't have a meeting that weekend. Um, so maybe if we could like push it back to like 9. I don't know if that's okay with everybody or not. Um, but maybe that would allow D, and I know it would allow me, to, like, get in to the chat. Because I'd love to chat with you guys IRL. Or at least IRT. Meh. See you guys later. See you strangers.